so today is Monday and it's our first full day on the ship today is a sea day we are on our way to Naples but we have a sea day first and then for the rest of the cruise we have no more sea days so this is our only one so we're going to go enjoy it and stay by the pool for a little bit today maybe go do some of the water slides and different activities on the ship but right now we're going to go upstairs and get some chairs and go for breakfast and then see what the day has to offer we'll probably go explore the ship more because we only did that a little bit yesterday like near the end of the day and I want to get some good footage for you guys so you guys can get a tour of the ship so right now we are going to go upstairs and get breakfast garden cafe area and we actually found a downstairs area which is actually La Cucina it's another restaurant but for breakfast and I'm not sure of lunch as well you can actually eat in here so it just looks like this and it's so cool it's right at the front of the ship so you have a great view I'll show you here if I can get to it you can see the front of the ship there and you have a great view so we're gonna continue exploring and I will show you guys what we see so we've just been hanging out by the pool for a little while I actually went up to the top deck to go tan for a while because where we are like we have this like covered area so it's nice and shady but I wanted to get some Sun so I went up top there for a while very hot then my brother and I went for a quick swim now I think we're going to go on to the um, water slides in a bit we're gonna get his GoPro and then probably go on them I think they're still open there people are people lining up they were closed yesterday so I think they're open today just because we're on a sea day so yeah we'll be there in a little bit we're heading back to the room but first we're actually going to go on to deck 13 which is where we are right now and we're heading to the very front of the ship there's something called like the bridge viewing room so I'm not sure if you can like see the bridge from that room or see like clear perspective or anything it just says on the map so we're gonna walk all the way to the front see if we can see anything there then walk all the way to the back get the GoPro and then walk back to the middle to go on the water slide to the bridge and I showed you some video but I couldn't actually film the bridge like I couldn't actually show you the captain and everything there was a security camera and it specifically said that we weren't allowed to so I didn't want to chance anything so it's really cool it's at the very front of the ship on deck 13 if you're ever on the epic make sure to walk all the way to the front of the ship I believe on the it's on the starboard side so the right side when you're walking on the ship and go all the way there and it's a whole room that you can literally see the captain and everything that he's doing and like his view as well it's really neat to see i've never seen that on a cruise ship before have you seen that before ryan no i've never i I never even have heard of it. I just happened to walk by and see a sign and I wasn't sure if we were even allowed to go So I just decided to check it out, but it's super cool. So definitely check that out But right now we are getting his GoPro ready and we're going to go on the water side and then probably stay and like Chill by the pool for a little bit longer. I'm not sure what time is it I don't have a clock anywhere, but it's probably around 1 o'clock or something So we're gonna go and head to the water side. We're back at the pool and we're heading on the water side try and see how to get Wi-Fi. I think one of our like onboard benefits is possibly free Wi-Fi. It's set on a paper 250 minutes, so I'm not sure if that means that we get a discount on that or what. So we're gonna try and see if we can get it for free. Wi-Fi on the ship is very expensive, so and they don't give you much for your money, so we're gonna, if we can get it for free, we'll get it. If not, then it's honestly not worth it. So we went to guest services and figured out that we actually do have 250 minutes of free Wi-Fi, or not free Wi-Fi, it's part of like one of the packages that you can get on board. So we have that, so we have to figure out how to set that up, and then we'll have that to the end of the ship. I've heard cruise ship Wi-Fi is very slow. We've never actually gotten it before, but I've heard it slow, so I'm not sure how it's gonna work, but I'll let you guys know. So I'm back in the room now, and I'm about to go take a shower and get ready for dinner. I'm pretty sure tonight is like 
their fancy night. They call it Norwegian's Night Out. It's a little loud out here. I'm gonna come back inside so I can talk to you. Ooh, I have to figure out how to close the door. But yeah, as I was saying, I'm pretty sure it's Norwegian's Night Out tonight. Um, it's basically where you dress up and it's like the formal night on the cruise ship. Norwegian, what we have found, we've only been on the escape for Norwegian, but what we found is that people don't dress up as much as they would on like Carnival or Royal Caribbean. So I'm not exactly sure what I'm going to wear, but they have like people taking photos of you throughout the ship, like different portraits. And so you tend to dress up a little nicer just to be able to take those photos, but we'll see what we end up doing. And then at 10 o'clock we have a show. Um, I'm not sure in which theater it is and I'm not sure the show, but I'll let you guys know once I find out. But yeah, right now I'm going to go take a shower and then I'll see you guys in a little bit. So we just finished getting ready and I'm just wearing this pink dress. It's not as formal as I normally go, but I decided to do a little bit less formal because people aren't wearing like super formal dresses tonight. Like typically on like Royal Caribbean and stuff like that, we do wear more formal dresses, but I guess it's more of like a Norwegian freestyle thing that they don't wear as formal dresses. So I'm going to get my brother to do my lookbook, but first we're going to go and get a pager for the Manhattan room. Last night we went around like 8 o'clock and it was super busy. Actually maybe it was closer to 9 o'clock and it was super busy. Everyone was eating at once. It was like a 45 minute wait. So we're going to try and get our pager earlier so we don't have to wait as long. I'm not sure if that's just like a thing with like the first night of the cruise or what. But I know on the escape, we never had to wait more than like five minutes. So I hope we don't have to be waiting the whole time this year, but we'll see. And yeah, so we're going to go film and then head to a show. I think we have a show at 10 o'clock. And yeah, that'll be our night. So we just finished filming my lookbook and now we're just waiting for the pager. Again, we did have to wait half an hour or that's what the pager thing said. It should be quicker considering we got it and it wasn't too busy down there. But we'll wait and see when it ticks off and I'll let you guys know if it was actually half an hour. I guess it's just something to know on the ship to get your pager while you're still getting ready and then once you're ready your table should be ready for you. But we're in the casino now and it's the same thing as the escape where the casino kind of goes throughout the second floor. Which is kind of different because people then can smoke throughout and if you're in Taste, this is Taste restaurant down here, if you're in Taste you can kind of smell the smoke. Which isn't like totally great if you're eating dinner but we actually haven't sat down there so I can't be 100% sure but from this area here you can definitely smell the smoke. So I'm assuming that you can there as well. But now we're going to go explore some more and I will show you guys some more clips. right now and Sandbar is like one of their shops they have the trade winds which is like they're more like high-end shops where you can buy like makeup and watches and jewelry and then here is kind of like their more souvenir shop thing Norwegian Escape didn't really have this so this is really nice they have like a bunch of like different like Spanish trinkets on this side and then more like Norwegian merch on that side so we're just exploring and finding new things We're in the midst of a lightning storm and I'm going to show you what it looks like. No, that one was the coolest. Whoa! So as you saw, that was crazy. We're like going right in the storm. It looks like it's really windy out there and I can see that it's raining and the waves look like they're pretty big, but we're not really feeling much, so that's good. It'd be cool to go to the um... Oh, that was a big one. I got a lot of footage, but we just saw another big one. It'd be cool to go to, where? To the uh, viewing area. Yeah, there's so the viewing area that I was showing you but earlier. it's closed during storms. Yeah, also. the viewing area I was showing you earlier, um, you can see out onto the bridge and it would be neat to like go into like what the captain is seeing, but they close it after sunrise and if this were a storm to happen like during 
the day they would obviously close it because they're having to deal with like a pretty big storm so yeah that's the coolest thing I've seen in a ship like we've never been in a storm like this ever but it might mean that tomorrow in Naples it is stormy so I hope that it's not but we'll have to see what tomorrow's vlog is like so stay tuned for that but we're gonna head back down to dinner because we left after the appetizer so we'll see you guys in a little bit so we finished eating and it actually took a little bit longer so we didn't make it to our show so now we're just walking around it took us around 40 minutes to get into the Manhattan room and then it was a little slow getting our food and everything so now we're just kind of exploring we missed our show by like an hour so we're kind of just seeing what's around here I'm not sure what we're gonna do maybe there's like some little shows that are going on that you don't have to book or we'll just explore more of the ship actually I think we're gonna go shopping we were by the trade winds place so I think we might go a look around and see what deals they have going on right mom you want to shop yes shop we're going to shop So we're back in the room now, we shop for a little bit and now we are going to head to bed because we have to wake up early tomorrow. Tomorrow we're in Naples and we have to be off the ship by like 8 o'clock I think. 8 o'clock? 8 o'clock? Around 8 o'clock. But um, I'll show you guys our animal. We didn't have one last night but tonight we have a little, I think it's a elephant. So it's just chilling there and then we have like our information and stuff for our free style daily. So yeah, I hope you guys have enjoyed today's vlog and enjoyed the sea day with us. Every next vlog we will be in some other place in Europe so we have no more sea days. So I hope you guys enjoyed this chill kind of vlog because all the next ones will be action packed. But yeah, I'll see you guys in my next video and make sure to like and subscribe and turn on your post notifications to keep track of my videos. See you tomorrow. Bye.